Hi Ranch Fam, this is Jima. Welcome back or welcome if you're new. What I want to go over today are some coupons that Dollar General has offered us and if they are stacking. I've been getting a couple of emails as well as I've been seeing it in the comments. So I wanted to take some time. Let's go over them now. But before I get started on that, I do want to mention I have already uploaded two videos today. One is one heck of a run deal. And the second one is Dr. Peppers for 50 cents. And it's most definitely at stock up prices. Please go back, view those videos. Don't forget to leave me a thumbs up on your way out and also any comments or questions. I greatly appreciate them. Okay, so let's talk about these coupons that Dollar General has offered us. And one specifically is the 10, get $10 off when you spend 40, okay? Now, if you look down at the bottom, it says purchase any P&G product in store from October the 26th through December the 1st. Once you purchase that P&G product, earn a $10 coupon to use when you spend 40 on P&G products on Saturday, December the 2nd. So one of the questions that I've been, out, been asked is, do they have to be P&G products? Yes, it says it right there on number two. And it says, when you spend 40 on P&G products on Saturday, December the 2nd. So you must take advantage of this deal this upcoming Saturday. And it says, shop in-store on 12-2 to use your $10 off of 40 coupon. So this is one heck of a deal. Hopefully you guys have earned your $10 coupon. Now, I have seen those coupons printed at the bottom of some of y'all's receipts, and I have seen them in digital form. Now, me personally, I got it in digital form. It did not print at the bottom of my receipt. So there you go, Dollar General, inconsistent once again. So if you did not get the PNG $10 coupon printed at the bottom of your receipt, you may want to check your account and clip it now. Okay, so again, I got it in digital form. Now, the question that I have been getting is, is our 5 off of 25 as well as our 5 off of 30 gain and our 10 off of 40, will they all stack come Saturday? Ranch fam, I don't have that answer for you all. Again, we're just going to have to wait till Saturday to find out. Now, if we spend $30 in gain, I know a lot of you guys have been telling me I used my gain, you know, I got $30 or $20 in gain, you know, with the 25 scenario and my five off of 25 and my five off of 30 gain did not stack. Now, I have said this in other videos. If you are shopping at a new system store, you must present a five off of 25 paper coupon to the cashier. Let them scan that, then enter your number into the digital keypad and your gain coupon, along with any other coupons that you're using within that transaction will come off. Now, the five off of 25 digital and the five off of 30 gain will not stack at a new system store, okay? You must use a paper five off of 25. Now that's what has me kind of guessing when it comes to this digital coupon. If you got it in digital form, I'm not sure how it's gonna work with the five off of 30 digital coupon and a five off of 25 maybe paper coupon, okay? We're all gonna have to wait till Saturday to find out how this is gonna stack or if it's even gonna stack at all. Now, if you got the PNG in paper form, it may stack with the gain digital. Again, I'm just guessing at that because that's how the five off of 25 works. So Ranch Fam, I don't have the answer for you if 
the five off of 25 and the five off of 30 gain and the 10 off of 40 PNG will stack. We're all gonna have to wait till Saturday. We're gonna have to play with it a little bit. I hope some of you out there have cashiers that will work with you to see if, you know, if they allow you to do certain transactions and maybe void it, see if it's stacking, all of that good stuff. You can bet I will be out there seeing if they're stacking. And maybe not all three of them, but hopefully, you know, one or the other, the gain or the five off of 25, hopefully it stacks with the PNG because again, that would be a $15 savings along with any other digital coupons that we may have within that transaction. So again, I'm not sure, but Ranch Fam, if you have not gotten your P&G printed at the bottom of a receipt, please go back and check your accounts because they are giving them in digital form as well. I've only received it in digital form. I have not gotten it printed at the bottom of my receipt. And you still have until tomorrow, which, which is Friday, December the 1st, to earn this coupon. All you need to do is go into your Dollar General, purchase a Procter & Gamble, a P&G product, and it this enter your number into the digital keypad, of course, and it will produce this coupon. Again, either in digital form or under your receipt, uh, you know, underneath your receipt. So again, we need to wait till Saturday to see if all three of these will stack or how it's going to play out. And I know a lot of you guys uh, are a couple of hours ahead of me. So if you guys go out and test this and you want to leave it in the comments of any of my videos, please do so for the rest of the Ranch Fam and for myself. Because by the time I get to the stores, you guys have already been shopping out there for two, three hours. Okay. So again, if you guys find out before me, I would greatly appreciate a comment or an email. And I can know what to expect when I go out there. And I'm still going to go out and test it myself. But again, for the rest of the Ranch Fam to also read. Okay, Ranch Fam. So let's wait till Saturday because who knows? They all may glitch and they all may stack. We'll find out first thing Saturday. Any comments, any questions, please leave them down below or you could send me an email. Our email address is in our description box of every video that we upload. Please give this video a big thumbs up, share it with family and friends so we can all benefit from these savings. This is Jima. Please subscribe, comment, like, and share this video. We'll talk to you soon.